Hey guys, what's going on? It's Voss with the Voss Coin YouTube channel. Today I'm here to talk to you about Zencash. Well, what is Zencash? Zencash is a privacy coin. What's a privacy coin? Privacy coins allow me to send secure, off the grid transactions from me to you. So, if I want to send you one Zen, which is the equivalent of 11 bucks right now, I could say, boom, one Zen to your address. You just send me your address, I can send it from my address, and you now have one Zen. Zen also has the capabilities to add messages to their transactions. So I could say, hey, thanks for buying me Chipotle last week. Appreciate it, man. Here's one Zen. And now you know why I sent you a Zen. And it also gives a little context of who it's from. I could also put a dash, you know, boss, so you know it's from me. Zencash can also be used for secure and anonymous publishing. So why would you use that? Say you want to post something that would simply jeopardize your safety, your family's safety, or jeopardize your job due to the opinion of it. I know there's a lot of controversial things going on right now, and based on what side you post an article, you could potentially be harmed and or lose your job based on your opinion for what you believe. So this would give you a secure private avenue to post these things, which I think is very valuable because the public cannot be censored. I believe that the secure and anonymous publishing aspect of Zencash is going to be absolutely critical to its success. And I think the widespread adoption of this could honestly truly change the world if this is the platform that it takes off with. Someone's going to do it. It's just a matter of if Zencash is going to be able to accomplish it, which I think they have a great team and the capabilities to do so. And by getting on with the currency now, well, you can support a mission like that. So let's talk a little bit about Zencash history. Zencash is the grandson of Bitcoin, essentially. Bitcoin, the OG, the godfather, the father of cryptos, not the mother of dragons. Come on, Game of Thrones reference, stick with me here. And basically, Bitcoin was born and it was the originator of cryptocurrency. And then Zcash came along. And it was essentially a clone of Bitcoin with an added level of security called ZK Snarks, among other things. And then Z Classic was a fork, or essentially a clone, in a nutshell, of Zcash. And that was more of a community project. They were changing some things. Then Zencash came along, and they forked, or essentially cloned, Z Classic to create Zencash and to manipulate it to their goals, their ideologies, and really just completely under their control and to birth a new crypto. What does that mean? Zencash is basically Bitcoin with added security and a different goal and development team behind it. Well, why do, why do we need it? There's already Zcash and there's already Bitcoin. It's taking a different avenue and it has a very active development team. And if you put a good team behind anything, they can make something useful and worthwhile. So I think Zencash has a bright future in that regard. Furthermore, the difference is, is that Zencash takes 8.5% to put back into marketing and development and research and then 3.5% will go to the secure nodes. So let's talk about the marketing and research. I think this is very important. I believe some currencies, they don't realize that it takes a ton of time and a ton of money to continue to develop and really market a product because if no one knows about X currency, then so what? You could have the best thing ever. If no one knows about it, it's never going to take off. It needs to get out there and be used and showcased and, well, this is a great product and here's why. Try it out. Try it for yourself. And so I think that's very important and I think that's going to be a key to the success of Zencash. Furthermore, secure nodes. That's very complex and in-depth, but basically secure nodes are going to be an integral part of making Zencash very secure, stable, anonymous, and absolutely decentralized throughout the world. So this is a very important part and the 3.5% is going to go to the people who host those nodes in order to keep the network alive and healthy and well. Zencash is a mineable cryptocurrency. That means it's a POW currency or proof of work currency. What exactly does that mean? It means that when I send Zencash from me to you, it needs to be verified on the blockchain. The miners do this work by building custom uh, GPU computers that verify the transactions and solve the block algorithm, which is Equihash, on the blockchain. Basically, they run the network for Zencash. In exchange for the mining slash computing power that the miners use, they receive block rewards. And what does that mean? It means for every block that's solved, pieces of Zen go to a mining pool where people who have built 
the GPU miners and connected them to the Zencash network receive a small piece of Zencash for their work. You're essentially outsourcing the network which enables the coin to be truly decentralized. This decentralization is critical in cryptocurrency and Zencash and it's what really keeps the heart pumping for the coin. Alright guys, so that's my Zencash 101. Hope you found this video helpful and informative. I wanted to give a brief basis of what is Zencash, how does it work, why, and what can you do with it. There's a lot more to learn about Zencash. If you'd like to learn more, make sure to check out their website, their Slack, they have their own forum, they're on the Bitcoin Talk forum, and much more. You can also subscribe to the Bosscoin YouTube channel to stay up to date on all my cryptocurrency content. This is Tails right here. She is the video producer. She does all the editing behind the scenes, and she's absolutely awesome. She's Shiba Inu, if you're not familiar with the breed, totally recommend it. If you want to get a dog that's going to just be awesome, super intelligent, change your life, and maybe even edit your videos, make sure you get a Shiba Inu. Thanks again for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed the content. I hope you found it helpful and informative. If you did, please make sure to subscribe to the Boss Coin YouTube channel. I'll see you guys next time.